Welcome to Tuesday Tip. This week we'll discuss topics for your tenant selection plan. Although HUD has recommended topics, owners and agents can make some of them required under their policies and procedures if they'd like to. As we go through them, think about which ones you'd like to make required and then please send Vicki an email and let us know why you're choosing them. So the following are recommended topics. You'll see some of them are highly recommended. One, applicant notification and opportunity to supplement the information they've already provided. Two, procedures for identifying applicant needs for the features of accessible units or reasonable accommodations. Three, highly recommended by HUD, updating the waiting list and procedures for staying on the waiting list. Another highly recommended topic, four, the policy for notifying applicants and potential applicants of changes in the TSP. Five, procedures for assigning units with originally constructed design features for persons with physical disabilities. HUD also highly recommends the next four topics. Six, charges for facility services and damages caused by resident or guest Seven, security deposit requirements and distribution. Eight, unit inspections and or pest inspections. And nine, annual recertification requirements, which is now in the HOTMA required documentation. Also in the required documentation, 10, interim recertification reporting policies. And the final three are all highly recommended topics. 11, notice of time implementation of house rule changes. 12, weapons on property, and 13, persons not on the lease who are living in the unit. So please take the time to review these topics. We've made a full list available for you on our website at navigatehousing.com slash HOTMA. Next week, Vicki will look at EIV policies in HOTMA. We'll see you then.